I'm Dr. Virgil Troy, and this is day three of my self-styled Barley Man Gladiator diet. Um, this eating on a regular basis consists of um, including barley, lentils, peas, beans, and vegetables in the diet. Uh, in fact, that is the diet, um, coupled with daily exercise of at least one hour or more, and it excludes all meat, dairy, processed food, oil, and sugar. So quite simple. And also includes the um, emission of alcohol, so no alcohol either. So two experiences as a result of uh, day three. The first one is that what I found yesterday is that I had so much food, and you can see what I ate in the description below, but so much food that by the time I came to eat my evening meal, there was too much. I actually couldn't eat it all. Um, so that's the first thing. And the benefit of that um, and fasting from seven o'clock at night through to seven in the morning is that having eaten my full, not being able to eat anymore, I was able to distinguish the difference between actually being hungry and those habitual nighttime or evening um, picking or eating habits. So when I found myself going to the refrigerator or looking inside the pantry, I had to remind myself that actually I'm not full. This is just a habit of eating last thing at night just because maybe watching a bit of TV, doing a bit of stretching or whatever it was, I'd have something to eat. So that's the first thing that was, I guess, um, uh, enlightening as a result of undertaking this process is having been full, not eating after that uh, because I put in place that fasting from 7 p.m. till 7 a.m. In terms of uh, energy and how I felt yesterday, plenty of exercise, um, plenty of energy to exercise, plenty of exercise. I did a lot of moving things around inside the house yesterday um, and in terms of um, mental clarity and having the mental energy to get through a day's worth of uh, market research work, uh, no issues there either. So good energy, um, good levels of mental clarity and I'm going to report on it um, at the end of the week but in terms of um, weight it has not gone up. In fact it's actually gone down. So um, I'm going to do some weights in the gym today and see if my strength has maintained its current levels. Anyway, it's all very promising. It's pretty much what I thought might happen, but it's a six-week exercise and we'll see just how well it holds its, um, its, its own over that period of time. So I will update you again tomorrow.